Hi everybody, I'm Ashad Kartalian and I'm going to show you a quick chart to help you with rhythmic durations of notes in relation to each other. At the top of the chart we have the whole note. The whole note has the longest duration out of all of the notes on the chart. The second longest duration belongs to the half note. Just like its name, the half note has half of the duration of the whole note. So you will need two half notes to cover the entire duration of one whole note. The quarter note works exactly the same way. Just like its name, the quarter note has one quarter the duration of the whole note and half of the duration of the half note, which means you will need one, two, three, four quarter notes to cover the duration of two half notes or of one whole note. The rest of the chart works exactly the same way, where each note value has exactly twice the duration as the note values directly below it. So, one quarter note will have the duration of two eighth notes, two eighth notes will have the duration of four sixteenth notes, and four sixteenth notes will obviously have the same duration as a one quarter note. So if you were to ask yourself, um, how many sixteenth notes are equal to one half note? Well, let's see. One half note, if you bring your fingers directly below, you will see that one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight sixteenth notes have the duration of one single half note. So anytime you're having troubles with rhythmic durations, just refer to this chart. I'm Ashut Kartalian, and I'll see you next time.